Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how bubble sort algorithm applies on a array and how it sorted the array elements in an increasing order. So let us first let me define an array. So before that, again let me define the size of the array. Define. Let us suppose I take ten. The array size of 10 so it will contain maximum size of 10 elements and let me place some of the elements in the unsorted unsorted way so 20 30 10 let us suppose take me 40 60 80 or 45 in an uns unsorted fashion so how much how many? 3 5 7 mm, 12 34 50 okay so we have added 3 5 10 elements and now we are defining the variables which uh, which we will need int i j and temp so the for loop let me initialize i equals to 0 i is less than of the max size less than equals less than max size and i gets incremented and in the inner for loop we are defining j which is nothing but i plus 1 so how exactly the bubble sort algorithm work let us suppose in this array the 20 is the first element 0th element or the index is 0 so this is the first element and this is the second element so okay if suppose the next element is greater than the previous element so it will simply swap the elements so in this fashion we are going to work okay j is i plus 1 j again less than the maximum size of the array and j gets also incremented so in the inner code we are simply swapping the elements okay so right here you can see I initialize I equals to 0 so it will simply contain the value 20 okay and the inner loop it will contain I equals to I plus 1 means 0 plus 1 so it will contain the value 30 and inside the for loop we will we will check if the 30 is greater than 20 if suppose this case so we will simply swap the array elements okay so inside there will be condition if a of j that is the next element is greater than a of i okay so a of j j will contain 30 and a of i will 20 if this case supposed to happen then let me temp temp variable and it will hold a of j okay this is nothing but the swapping logic temp variable will contain a of j we are assigning and a of j will contain a of i and a of i will contain the temp this is the swapping logic i hope you might you may know okay we have simply swapped and after that we are coming out of the for loop and simply printing the element so again we will need one more for loop for printing 
the array elements for i equals to 0 i is less than the maximum size okay and i plus plus inside that let me just scroll down inside that we are simply writing a printf statement for send d this is the placeholder let's take a space and a of i so this for loop prints all the array elements in a sorted fashion so what our output will go 10 20 30 40 45 in that fashion okay so let me run okay we get an error undeclared a so okay so where exactly we have defined a double r array and here we have just use a okay let me check is there any error again we are getting this error sorry 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 we have simply used a so we have to just a double r okay and now again run the code sorry 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 we just need to put a double r in the whole code okay right here also required a double so you might note you might see that the we are the array elements get sorted but in the decreasing order so where will where what exactly we have did we simply need the array of j is less than okay now it will print in the ascending order 10 12 20 30 and likewise okay so thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel